I mean, as comedians, we end up taking a lot of flights, we travel a lot, and we get to see some crazy things. Like, have you flown by SpiceJet? That in-flight announcement is just a little weird. They say things like, we're flying at 50,000 feet. The temperature outside is minus 50 degrees Celsius. We're now flying over Bombay, Jai Hind. <laughs> I'm telling you, Jai Hind scares the shit out of me. Man. I also flew by Air India recently. They've improved, they've improved. My two hour flight was only delayed by four and a half hours. And after this gigantic delay, we finally get to the aircraft and there is this ancient, ancient gentleman who's giving the safety instructions. This guy was struggling so much by the time he came to the oxygen mask demonstration. I was like, sir, aap khud laga lo, aapko zada zarurat. And now you have all these crazy restrictions on security, you know, about what you can take inside the cabin. See, some security is important. But some of these rules are ridiculous. Like, who are you going to assault with a nail cutter? <laughs> when has a flight ever been hijacked with you? Flight Pakistan me land kar do, nahi to tumhare nakhun kaat do. <laughs> if he stays in a hostel, wo khush rahega, chhe mene tak usne khud nahi kaate hoenge. <laughs> And I had this very eye-opening social experience recently on a flight, you know, like, I was sitting in economy class and I saw my friend sitting a few rows ahead in business class. And I had this awkward moment, should I go up and talk to him? Will he accept me, recognize me? You know, a bit like Sudama going up to Krishna. And I went up, guys, and we started talking. He's like, are you on the same flight? I said, yeah. He's like, then what are you doing back there? I was like, hunting for Pokemon? What else could I say, man? Have you noticed that when you get into a flight, you will always cross the business class people first. And these guys will not even look at you. It's almost like, inki karibi mujhe nahi lag jai. It's like business class people are like the South Bombay people of the aircraft world. And you know, they've started depriving you so much in economy, you start getting angry, man. Like a non-business wale insan nahi hote kya? When did insan class become lower than business class? What kind of capitalism is this? But it's better than communism. Because communism is like, soon, sabko plane chalane ka equal mokha mein. <laughs> then you have that crazy emergency exit seat for leg space. And nowadays when the air hostess comes, she's stopped giving a damn, okay? It's just randomly, uh, please don't sit here, okay? Please don't spread your legs, please don't open the door. Mutual front and subject markers, please don't open the door. It's got kuch farak nahi padta hai. I had an old couple sit next to me and straight away this female was panicking. She came up, sir, you can't sit here, an old couple. So first she asked the uncle, sir, will you be willing to operate the emergency exit? He's like, hey? I'm like, I think that answers your question. Then she asked the auntie, Madam, will you be able to lift 10 kilos? And she's like, what are you asking me? It's going to be a roadies audition. 10 kilos will take you, you'll sit in the emergency exit. Then she asked the uncle, sir, will you be able to lift 10 kilos? He's like, why are you talking like this? Why are you asking me these questions? Uncle has taken it on the side. Have you ever getting bored on a flight? Trust me, it's the place where crazy things happen. I was chatting with this Air India hostess and later on I saw her LinkedIn profile. It said, hi, I'm an air hostage. Look, she's from Air India, it may not be an error, okay? <laughs> and then I went to the washroom, there's a gigantic line of people waiting as usual. At that time, you get a little worried, you know, like, what if the person who's gone before you leaves the washroom in a complete mess? See, guys, be honest, your biggest fear is what if the rest of the line thinks you made that happen? How will this profile look at my Because you see the craziest things on a flight, guys. I actually saw this on an Air India flight once. Two passengers sitting next to each other. This person asked the guy next to him, Sun, what do you want to do? He said, Kuch nahin, you want to press the button? I swear, this guy pressed the button and went like this, Why do you want to press the button? Ganga Jai. 